Imagine gazing at the horizon and witnessing a sunrise that fills half the sky. NASA has unveiled images of a previously unseen phenomenon. The star Betelgeuse ejected a massive portion of its surface. This event, called a surface mass ejection, released 400 billion times the mass of a typical solar flare from our sun. Join us on this cosmic journey. Just seven minutes ago, Betelgeuse's catastrophic explosion began unfolding. Scientists are calling this a rare opportunity to witness stellar evolution in real time, with the star shedding enormous chunks of its physical form, surprising many. The colossal explosion of this red supergiant challenges much of what we know about the universe. Why did Betelgeuse erupt, and what does this mean for the cosmos? Let's explore. Constellations, made up of numerous stars, are intertwined with mythology and legends and are still used for navigation today. One of these stars is Betelgeuse, among the largest and brightest in the night sky. This shimmering ruby-red star is located at the upper right shoulder of Orion, the Hunter constellation, and can be easily spotted due to its striking reddish hue. However, to astronomers, it's a pulsating beast with a 400-day rhythm of regular contractions. Because of its vivid color, Betelgeuse is ideal for proving that stars indeed have varying colors. Also known as Alpha Orionis, Betelgeuse is the second brightest star in the constellation, surpassed only by the blue supergiant Regal. Betelgeuse has long fascinated astronomers due to its variability and its peculiar name. Interestingly, while the title Alpha is often reserved for the brightest star in a constellation, Betelgeuse holds this designation despite Rigel being brighter. Its size, brightness, and reddish glow make it one of the most well-known stars. Notably, Betelgeuse served as the inspiration for both the character and the movie Betelgeuse. It is the seventh brightest star visible from most of North America, Europe, and Canada, and the tenth brightest star overall. Although Earth is relatively close to Betelgeuse, astronomers can't pinpoint its exact distance, but estimate it lies between 430 and 724 light-years away. Betelgeuse is the closest and brightest red supergiant star to Earth, and only 200 red supergiants have been identified in our galaxy. Its size is staggering, with a radius about 764 times larger than the Sun's. If it replaced the Sun in our solar system, it would engulf the orbits of Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars, extending past the asteroid belt and even beyond Jupiter. This suggests that Betelgeuse is 16,128 times more massive than the Sun. It boasts 126,000 solar luminosities and has a surface temperature of around 3,600 Kelvin, cooler than the Sun. Only about 13.3% of Betelgeuse's radiant energy is visible light. If human eyes could see all wavelengths, Betelgeuse would outshine Sirius as the brightest star in the night sky. Betelgeuse sheds about one solar mass every 10,000 years. The red giant is surrounded by a nebula, a cloud of material 250 times larger than the star itself, formed as Betelgeuse ejects material unevenly in all directions. The nebula is about 30 astronomical units wide, which is 30 times the distance between the Sun and Neptune the farthest planet in our solar system. Our sun also ejects mass into space, known as solar flares, though it only emits small fragments of its outer atmosphere in an event called a coronal mass ejection, CME. These CMEs can occur separately from surface mass ejections. A CME on Betelgeuse, however, was extraordinary because it released 400 billion times more mass than a typical CME, causing the star to tremble like gelatin, according to NASA. This event occurred in 2019, when material from the star erupted, cooled, and formed a dust cloud that obscured Betelgeuse's brightness from Earth-based observers. The star's regular pulsation pattern was also disrupted. Andrea Dupree, an astronomer at the Center for Astrophysics, noted that the star's internal convection cells might be in chaos, and its photosphere, what we see as the star's surface, is struggling to restore itself. Astronomers have observed Betelgeuse's steady pattern for over 200 years, but that consistency no longer exists. All red giants, including Betelgeuse, are nearing the end of their lives. Observing Betelgeuse's demise provides valuable insights into stellar evolution. Most stars, powered by nuclear fusion, eventually burn out and undergo fascinating transformations before dying. When a star like Betelgeuse exhausts its hydrogen, it starts fusing helium into carbon, then heavier elements like neon and iron. 
Once the fusion of these heavier elements fails to release energy, the star collapses under its gravity, triggering a supernova, one of the most powerful forces in the universe, capable of releasing more energy than 10 billion suns. Throughout their lifetimes, stars change color. Ancient astronomers described Betelgeuse as a yellow star, suggesting it may have been a yellow supergiant before becoming red. Astronomers hope Betelgeuse will provide new insights into how red stars lose mass before they explode in a supernova. As Dupree noted, we've never seen a surface mass ejection of this magnitude before. While it's unclear if this signals Betelgeuse's imminent supernova, NASA believes the star is nearing the end of its life, but likely won't explode for another 100,000 years. Scientists such as Serena Nance have simulated Betelgeuse's behavior to predict when it might explode. In early 2020, Betelgeuse lost three times its usual brightness, sparking rumors of a supernova. However, the star later brightened and infrared observations showed no signs of an impending collapse. The dimming was likely caused by large circumstellar dust clouds, not a core collapse. Betelgeuse's fluctuating brightness in 2020 surprised astronomers, and some suggest a second dimming event could occur sooner than expected. Recent studies link the dimming to a surface mass ejection, where material expelled from the star cooled, forming a dust cloud that obscured Betelgeuse. Backyard astronomers could even observe this dimming with the naked eye. Although Betelgeuse is gradually recovering from its massive outburst, it continues to puzzle astronomers, with its surface vibrating like a bell struck by a hammer. The event has left astronomers perplexed, as nothing like it has been observed before. While Betelgeuse's eventual supernova won't threaten Earth, it will be an awe-inspiring event, providing invaluable data for astronomers. For now, Betelgeuse isn't visible in the night sky. But when it eventually explodes, it will be one of the most extraordinary astronomical events humanity will witness. Thank you for joining us on this cosmic journey. Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and click on the video on your screen for more mind-bending content. Until next time, keep gazing at the stars. This is Cosmic Inquiries, signing off.